Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I am here to start my Erin Condren spread for the week of April 22nd to May 3rd. It's kind of crazy that it is May. Um, in some ways it feels like the first four months have flown by and in other ways it feels like each month has been a year. <laughs> Um, it is currently Wednesday night, the 29th, so I'm going to put my base down at least and see where I get. Um, I am using a kit called, I think it's just called Tulips by Ruby Red Iris Prints. Um, I will link her shop down below. It's not the first time that I've used one of her kits, but it is the first time that I've used them on my channel. Um, I used one last year in my digital planner and I will pop up a little digital flip through of the kit because as usual I did modify them slightly to get um, exactly the boxes that I wanted and needed um, for my planner because as some of these I think this sheet was originally different and so was this one but you'll see as I flip through um, or as the digital flip through uh, pops up on the screen. So I am going to speed through the next little bit. I'll play some music for you and then we will be back to do um, some day to day. Okay, well, if you could not tell, I was riding front seat on the struggle bus for this one. I apparently forgot how to put down a planner spread at all. Um, put my glitter headers in the wrong place, couldn't get them lined up up here. Forgot this one entirely and then didn't know where it was. Whoa. Anyway, and now I see that I have fajita sauce on my hands from dinner. So... So I think I am going to try to get at least um, a day or two done in here um, before I call it a night and go to bed. So um, Monday morning I was up super, super early. It was one of those nights where I felt like I didn't even sleep and I know I probably did, but it did not feel that way. So I definitely want to mark that. Okay, so I'm gonna pull a leftover um, alarm clock here, or maybe the purple one um, for that. So I'll use a little, I think I'll go, oh, I don't wanna use, oh, I see. Okay, well, I don't have to use them for what they're for. So let's do a little whiting out. Gonna cover that, yeah. Okay, and then we'll grab, I think this one. Mm. There, we'll grab that to mark that I was up really early. And had a terrible sleep. Um, and then I filmed my Erin Condren. So this um, spread from last week. This one here. So for that, I think 
I will use this one. And then I will pull out a little recording bandit for that. I don't think this kit comes with... No, it doesn't come with any icons, which is a little strange, but that's okay. Alright, we will use the last pink bandit, recording bandit here. Maybe. Okay. Um, and then I ran some errands. So I know that there are a couple to buy. And I'm just looking to make sure. Okay. So I think I'm going to use one of. The, oh, there's just one to buy. Maybe I'll just use the today. I'm going to put a header here, like a, some kind of title box, I'm thinking one of these, maybe I'll just do the green to match, because I don't have tons of other things to mark on Monday. Okay, so we'll write errands in there, or I'll grab a little script and put that in. All right, then I finished watching Hillary on Netflix, which was, it was so good. Um, so let's grab one of these. to mark that and I do have a Netflix binge sticker that I will use for that in the evening we watched 30 Rock which was the first time that my family has seen it so that was fun so I'm just trying to decide between a little because then after that I edited. So if I am going to use, I don't think that will fit, a little and a half box are probably my best bet. So I'll pull this one. And then I think I think this is going to be big enough. No. So we use a half. And I don't think I'll get one of these in, but let's just see. Oh, I would just. It didn't actually cut very well, though. So let's just stick with this. So that was for editing. So let's grab what we have here. This is sort of. Mm, Use this very neutral ish one. Or not. There we go. So that was for watching TV. And this is for editing. Okay, that was Monday. Tuesday, I started the day with a really quick shower, but I'm not gonna mark that it wasn't, like it was literally just like a functional shower. And then um, my husband and I had a phone meeting with the bank. So, actually, do this one. I don't mind that it's green on green. I don't 
know if these boxes are funny sizes or if suddenly, like, I just can't, I don't know how to put them down anymore. It appears to be the latter. Excellent. All right. So, okay, so I'll just grab one of these phone icons to mark that it was um, by phone. Oh yeah, it's like cement paper. Okay. And then I helped my daughter with some schoolwork. So let's mark that with one of these, I think. Oh, actually it was kind of a busy day. So let's put that back and we will use, what do we have? I'm going to use this one. And I'll grab maybe a book icon for that. To mark studying, so maybe this here. Okay, then I filmed, so I am going to, oh, these are a little bit different. Which ones, oh, I see, okay. So, let's grab this one. And I both filmed and edited, so I will mark that in one box. I don't think I will use a bandit. I will put um, a script in there. Okay, and then I had to call the bank. And I actually had to call them twice because I really, like, literally the second that I hung up the phone with them, I realized that they and we had gotten some things wrong with our account and I wanted them to fix it so I called them back right away so I'm gonna mark that down because I feel like I was on the phone with them for a thousand years even though it was probably more like an hour and I will grab where did my phone icons go here they are. I'll grab this to mark that here as well. Alright, after that, um, we had a video call with my in-laws. So I think I will put down probably I do this. No, I want, might have enough space. So put this here. to mark the video call and then we had a little bit of family time in the kitchen because our daughter was just having a rough night. And then I edited, which I was going to mark, none of this is straight, guys. I was going to use a third box for that, but I don't think, no, it's not going to fit. So, let's 
So I guess I'm going to replace this with this. And we will move this up. And then we'll grab, what color will we grab? I have no idea when my camera cut off because I wasn't paying attention, but in any case, I've got this to mark the video call with my in-laws, this to mark family time, and then this for editing my Erin Condren. <clears throat> Rewind. Okay, this morning I did some design work. I think I'll bring in one of these. I don't think I'll need to white anything out on this one. But I will need to reposition it. Come on. Okay, so that was for design. So I'm gonna grab a bandit. Where are my little design bandits? So I have these, which are kind of huge, but in here, my leftover box, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think one of these will go. So I'm thinking this one here should kind of match as the salmon. Let's so put her there for designing. And then I filmed a ton. Um, and it took, it did take actually a huge chunk of time. So I'm sort of thinking about bringing in some washi to sort of mark that or I may just bring in one of these but I think what I'll do first is work my way up from the bottom because there aren't too many other things to mark down today so I'm finishing the day by filming Okay, um, just before filming, my husband baked brownies. Well, just before I came upstairs, my husband baked brownies. And they were delicious. So let's use this one for that. Okay, um, and that's literally it other than, dis uh, sorry, other than filming. So, where am I, here they are. However, I do wanna mark that I didn't feel great today. So, if I put, oh yeah, I forgot these were cut kinda off. But if I put that there, I don't love this. I don't know that I'm going to move it either. So if I put that there, then I could pull in like a whole other half box to mark that I wasn't feeling well. I don't really need 
a whole half box for that. So maybe what I will do is just put this. Actually, I should pull in a pink one. Kind of that's good. So we'll put the light pink here. And then I think I will try bringing in some of the purple washi. So I used to do this a lot when I planned in an hourly planner and I have hardly done it at all since then. But I did always like the way that it looked. So I think I want it down the middle. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. So I'm going to leave it for now and see what I think as time goes on. I sort of feel like it would have been better with a different box. I don't think maybe the purple one here. I just feel like it shows through a lot see if we switch it out for this still shows through but I think I kind of like it better There, that shows more of the washi. I think that looks a bit better. Okay, and that was for recording. And I don't have any sort of neutral ones, but I do have this pinkish one, which will do fine. Recording? Yes, recording. Okay, and then this is for recording as well, but I don't think... I will mark that. Let me just see if I have something here I can use. Thinking maybe this. Yeah, that'll be fine. Okay. So that is the first half of the week done. I am not in love with this kit. I thought I was going to like it a lot more than I do. But it's also not the worst. So... I mean, I'm committed now. It's all down on the page. I'm going to finish out the week with it. Um, not every spread has to be my favorite, but we'll see. Hopefully, as the week goes on, I'll like this one more. I will see you in a couple days for the next half of the week. All right. It is a Saturday morning, almost Saturday afternoon. It's two minutes to 12. So I am back to do a couple days, two and a half days in here, and then tomorrow I will finish off the rest. Um, just before I jump into Thursday, I did pick up these um, Isolation Day stickers from Planarology Studio, and I thought I might add one here just to mark um, which day. I think I'm going to go back and put them in for previous weeks as well. Um, I just want to mark right off the bat that it is. I'm going to need a narrower pen for that. Maybe... Oh, here's a brand new one. Um, using a Pentel Energel 0.5 for this um, because it is day, this would be day 43. So we will have to write rather small. Actually, don't like the way that looks. Hold on. That is only a tiny bit better, but it is going to do. 
So I'm just going to stick this down here. Okay, to mark that. I don't know yet if I'll put them on every day or just sort of the beginning of the week. We'll see. We'll see also how, how long this goes on. That might make a difference too. All right, so to start off, you know, it'd be helpful if I had the stickers I'm using this week. All right, to start off Thursday, I had a shower and blow dried my hair. Um, so I'm going to mark that. I don't remember. Oh, there's like no washi in this kit. That is, how did I not notice that before? Weird. Okay. I'm going to, I think I'll use one of these then and I'll just cover up the, the work part if I can. Shouldn't need to white any of this stuff out here. Um, so I pulled out my little shower and hair drying um, bandits. So let's do this light pink one here. Hopefully it'll cover. Oh, I don't think it's going to cover the whole thing. There is, let me pull out my little bin here. There's a girl washing her hair that might work better. Let's try this, oops. So let's use this one. Shoot. Okay, what if I turn it upside down? Maybe the hair drying girl will cover it better. That's straight. Mm, can't be. So if we grab this one. Yeah, that'll work fine. Okay, so we'll use, whoops, her and her to mark that. Uh, and then, so I just had, after that, I had a conversation with my daughter just about what was going to happen that weekend. She was supposed to go on Friday to her mom's house for the weekend, which I think I mentioned earlier in the week. Um, and she ended up going Thursday night instead, which was great for them, uh, for everyone. Um, and we had, but we just had a, a chat about it. So I wanted to use... I wanted to use one of these. I just don't love that the no the box got cut off there. All right, let's pull this instead. And I don't have a little bandit for this one, but that's okay. Or any kind of icon. So we did that. Then my husband came home sick. He was not feeling well. So he he um, started work at 9.30 and he was home by noon. He just didn't, he felt really crummy on Friday, no, Thursday. So, oh, crap. <laughs> I'm like so disorganized here. So maybe, maybe one of these. So we'll use this. to put there and he was fine in the end he went to bed and he slept for like four hours um, and felt a lot better when he woke up but I'm just going to mark that with that little sick day icon there where am I putting things here I'm all over like all over the place <sighs> okay um, so that happened and then I did a ton of editing. Well, I edited my 
mega monthly um, plan with me. So I use here. So we will mark that. I don't think this is going to show through, but let's wait it out just in case. Okay, and I also picked up from Planarology Studios some of these little uh, film edit and upload icons, so um, you may see those a couple times in this video. Let's put that there for edit. Okay, then I did something that I have not done even once this quarantine until Thursday. I'm just going to fix this a little crooked. And that was that I had a nap. I have not once had a nap in quarantine despite being home this entire time. And I think the only reason I did it was because my husband was napping and I was like, oh, you know what, that actually sounds kind of nice. I think I'm going to do that too. <laughs> so I laid down for, it wasn't very long, it was probably for an hour or so. Um, and had a nap. And for that, I've got a little face mask here. So let's put that like in that. What is. Ew. Okay. After my nap, I took my daughter to her mom's house. So I'm going to put, I want to mark it, but I don't want to, I'm not going to use like a whole box for it, or a giant box anyway. So let's use a little, whoops, need this. So grab a little. that there and then I did grab a couple like my leftover car icons because there aren't any icons in this kit and I think I'll grab this little purpley one here it won't clash just to cover that up and then my husband and I ordered takeout and watched the pharmacist on Netflix so I'm hoping will I get a half box in there hmm, just how that would look it's really tight but it's only tight because of this box it's okay pull a third there that looks like it fits better I actually think I'm going to move it down a tiny, tiny bit. Okay, and then I also got these order takeout stickers from Planerology, and we ordered Chinese, so I'm going to put this here. I think be there. Mm, I don't like that there. Okay, we'll leave that there and I will um, write in that we watched the pharmacist as well. So that was Thursday. Friday, so yesterday I started the day by um, just sitting with my husband before he went to work and having breakfast so I think I'll pull this one and I think this girl's hair is gonna get in the way a bit so let me lift that whoops sorry that was probably really loud
And I do have a little breakfast icon here. So let's pull her up and we'll just mark that. And we didn't, I think she's eating like, what is she eating in here? Like bacon and eggs. We definitely didn't do that. We had cereal, but <laughs> the sentiment was the same. All right, then I edited. So many of these boxes are the same shape. It's hard to know what to use. This is kind of a different one. This is, I mean, it's still a third box, but I don't know if you can see, it's kind of like ombre. So we'll use this for editing. But it did not take me that long. All right, we'll pull, no, that's the same. Oh, so many of these boxes. Okay, let's pull this one. Okay, and then I think for that, I, yes, so I wanted to use one of these. So why don't we use the script one this time? Edit there. All right, then I tidied up my office a little bit. Not, not really tons. <laughs> Um, there are no good, I've said this before, there are no good tidying, at least I haven't found any good tidying icons yet. I am still looking, probably only need, so what else do I have to mark? So I tidied my office, I did some printing and cutting. I did some Etsy prep. And then dinner with my husband. So I think I will just use a little one for this. And the only icon that I could find that I thought about using was one of these girls. Um, because when I tidy my office, it really is a lot of sort of putting paper away uh, when you're a paper crafter. That's what happens. But I feel like I'd probably be better off finding a little vacuuming icon. So let me, and not like, not this one, she's too big, but more of a cleaning like something in here so let's see what we have so vacuuming something that won't clash does such a thing exist I'm thinking maybe that one I don't even know if you can see it's so very very light hold on in my hobo leftovers I have other vacuums. So those. So I actually think one of those pink ones might work because it's pretty close. So let's grab this. Yeah, that'll actually work pretty well. Okay, okay. Tidied my office and then I did a whole bunch of Etsy prep. Let's put that away. Where? Oh, no. Before I did that, I did some printing and cutting. So let's mark printing and cutting with a green box, I think. And I think I will just put the icons here like I 
have done a few times before. Print and cut. And it was the Planarology Studio icons that I was printing and cutting. Okay, then I did a whole bunch of Etsy prep. So let's mark that off there. And it was um, taking photos for listings that I was doing. Kind of feel like finally using this and just biting the bullet and not worrying that it's not perfectly cut. Okay, and I do have a little camera icon for this. So I think we'll pull her. It is blue, not pink, but I think the, um, it sort of looks a little like the purple. So let's put her there. Oh dear. I feel like this is getting worse and I don't know what's causing it. Okay, while I was doing that, I'm going to mark it down because I think it's monumentous. <laughs> I was watching a Netflix special. And it was Don't F With Cats. And I have been literally trying to get my courage up to watch that for... Well, when did it come out? Ever since then. Pause one second. So the other thing, I, the only other thing I have to mark down is um, dinner with my husband. So I'm thinking about. I'm just gonna work backwards on this. So we'll put that there. Okay. And then we'll grab a box like this for Netflix. So I've wanted to watch it. Um, and I, my husband watched like one part of one episode and then had to turn it off. This is months ago because of the violence towards animals. And that's what's made me hesitate. But I felt like a bit of an asshole for not, for not watching it for that reason, because I actually accidentally saw the video of the murder in that case um, when it happened. So, so I wanted to watch this documentary because like if I, I mean I didn't enjoy watching the video of the murder but if I could handle that and, and move on from it then, then I should be able to watch the documentary about the guy. So I am going to mark that. I just want to, I was going to use a Netflix and binge, or Netflix binge, but, um, it wasn't, like, it wasn't really a binge. Maybe I'll just put a little TV. I think I'll just put a little TV. And then I will use the binge for, uh, dinner. Um, sorry, watching with my husband later. So, the other reason that I wanted to watch it was that I, um, I'm from Montreal where this murder took place. Um, oh shoot, I was going to move that over, but now clearly I'm not, uh, born and raised there. So definitely, you know, sort of hometown crime, if you, if you will. And I, I'm just going to see if I can cut this because it wasn't, we, my husband and I didn't even binge, I think we watched one episode. We might have watched two. And, you know, certainly like living in Canada at the time that, that these, uh, the murder victim, June Lynn's body parts were being mailed to our prime minister and a school, um, so yeah, it was, it was a weird time. Certainly it was, you know, it was a time that, that I remember very well. We talked about it at work sort of every day at lunch. And, and I really, I did want to watch the, um, the documentary. I followed the case very closely. So I did finally start it yesterday. There was, I think 
one or two scenes, one scene in the first episode and one scene in the second where I just skipped 10 seconds ahead and then and Netflix because I, I knew I wasn't going to want to see it and I decided that was okay to do and everything is fine. I haven't finished it yet, but I'm going to today, probably right after I film this. Okay, on to today. All right, I had a terrible sleep. Like a full on terrible sleep. And I don't know why. Well, I know why, I just don't know why it happened last night. I have restless leg syndrome pretty badly at times. I've had it my whole life. My whole family actually has it. And it is horrible. But for me, my restless leg syndrome has almost always gotten better when I've gotten into bed. So it's always been an indication for me that I'm tired and need to go to bed. Sometimes... So lately, as I've gotten older, that's like not always the case. I do get restless legs in bed sometimes. Occasionally, it doesn't happen a lot. Occasionally, that's a very big sticker for what I'm about to write in here. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, occasionally it doesn't happen very often, but occasionally I am woken up in the night, literally thrashing my legs around because like I'm woken up by my restless legs. It's horrible. I hate it when that happens. When it happened this morning, I thought, okay, well, please let it at least be like 4.30 or 5 in the morning and I'll just get up. Um, Because I knew, like, you have to get up when it happens. Like, you can't, at least I can't, like, lay in bed and sort of will it to go away. <laughs> That's not going to do anything. I'm going to grab... Maybe this girl here, but I'm going to, or maybe this one, um, not quite as bright a blue. But I might cut off the coffee cup. I'm going to see what it looks like. So, yeah, I was hoping that it would be, yeah, you know what, it's going to be fine. I was hoping it would be at least like 4.30 or 5. I could just get up. It would be fine. But, no, it was... 2:20 in the morning. So I did get up because you have to when that happens. This is a cute little coffee cup. And I came downstairs and I watched another episode of Don't Don't F with Cats. And I was up from 2:20 to 3:45 and then I went back to sleep. Okay, that brings us to when I woke up this morning, which was about 9.30. And I went and sat with my husband in the kitchen for a while before he went to work. And then I stayed there a little while and I just hung out with our Frenchies. Well, with all our dogs, but with the Frenchies especially need like extra company in the morning sometimes. So we'll just mark that there. And then we are up to filming. So I will mark filming. And then I will be up to date on it. So, I don't use this weird purple one. And I grabbed both the film um, script and icon from Planarology and the, like my own little film thing there. I think I'll use this one. So that is filming and that 
brings us current. So it is now 12.30. I am going to hopefully edit some of this spread at the beginning of the week um, this afternoon. And other than that, I'm going to tidy up my office again because it's already a mess. <laughs> and then, I don't know, then maybe I'll relax, which is a crazy concept, but who knows, maybe I'll do it. So I will probably be back tomorrow evening to finish the rest, maybe pop in tonight to finish Saturday, we will see, and I will see you then. Okay, I'm back, it is Sunday night, we are going to finish up this spread. So when I left off yesterday afternoon, um, so what did I do in the morning? I, I had a very rough morning while I was awake, uh, from what, 2.20 to 3.45 in the morning, um, spent some time snuggling with the dogs, and then I filmed this. Um, after that, I did some sticker organization with my leftover sticker kits, which um, if you haven't seen the video about how I organize my leftover sticker, sticker kits, and you want to see that, I will, um, I'll try to put a card like up here I haven't quite figured out how to do that yet um, the only time that I was able to do it I actually wanted to put it up like on the whole video so obviously need to play around with that a little bit more but I will do that and try to link that here if you're looking for ideas for storing your leftover kits so let's put that there and I've got a little bandit here um, and I'm using this one because this is usually what it looks like when I have been organizing um, sticker kits because um, there are so many leftover papers usually. After that I filmed again and I filmed my hobo um, for this coming week. So. And then my husband and I, sorry I yawned, um, and then my husband and I wa uh, made pizza and I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to do this. I think what I might do, of course, the second I sit down to film, I get a tickle in my throat. So hold on, let me just, okay, so if I put this here, I can put another sort of third box there. So let's just stick this one down. And we'll come back to that in a second. So I filmed my hobo spread. So let's mark this here. <clears throat> like so. And I have a tiny little script here. Just the ones that I printed on um, the clear sticker paper and oops nope here so let's put that here actually see if i can move down a bit there we go and then like i said we made homemade pizza after that so let's use these are new i just got these um tonight and printed them before I filmed so let's see if I can grab one of these little pizzas here there we go because we had delicious homemade pizza and we watched part of what did we watch we watched the end of the pharmacist and then we started watching how to fix a drug scandal um, which I've also already seen and then my husband fell asleep so we turned that off all right we are up to this morning so this morning i slept on and off until about 10 30 which was lovely <laughs> so i'm gonna mark that with this sticker here and again i think i said this when i was filming yesterday but i don't love how few box options there are in this kit. I thought I had like tons of extra boxes 
Um, but I would have done better. I would have done well to create some of the ones that, that I make <clears throat> for myself. Because there just were not a lot of options in this kit. I feel like they're all the same size. Anyway, I have a bandit for that as per usual. And I think I'm going to pull... Maybe we'll just go pink on pink here. She's very large. Okay, put her there. And then I had a glorious shower and blow dry my hair. <clears throat> Which you guys know I like to mark. <laughs> because why not? Because there's nothing else to mark these days. And also, I think I mentioned this in another video, but I have blow dried my hair more often in the past, like since we've been in isolation than I had like in the year before. Okay, let's grab, I think this one here. So shower and then I'm just going to use this hair dryer because I haven't used these before and they're cute and I have, oh I only have one other this week but that's okay. If I can get this secret, there we go. Um, I'm going to cut off. I'll have to use these ones. I'm going to cut off the cord on that so that it doesn't take up too much room here. I think I'll just angle it a bit, like maybe like that. Okay. And then we had a nice relax on the couch. Just hung out with the dogs. My husband and I were kind of doing our own things on our phones and just chilling. Don't. I don't even know where that. Oh, I have one other like that, I guess. Here. Okay, let's use that one then. Doing Putting stickers down on Sunday is always hard for me because I can't get as close to the page or to like my planner it's still not straight okay it's a bit better and then I have another new bandit sheet with this little cutie who's just laying on the couch and I think this is meant to be a nap but I'm going to use it just as a relaxing sort of lazy day so maybe this one and we will just put her there so after we relaxed we did do we did a little bit of yard work um and by yard well my husband did yard work i cleaned up our deck grab this one here that i was gonna use above and we'll fix that too <laughs> And then I have, <clears throat> excuse me, and then I have one more um, or another little new uh, sheet here. These are the gardening bandits, um, which I didn't do gardening, but I did do deck cleanup. So I'm just going to put those there to mark that. Okay, so that took a couple hours or so. And then... After that, I watched um, some more of the Trials of Gabriel Fernandez. So, so I have three more things to mark. So I have that, 
I have a driveway visit from my mom. And then filming this. So I think for filming, I'm just going to use... I'm just going to go backwards a little bit here. So for filming, I'm going to use just a little because it really was the end of my day. So I think so. Not yet sure what color. So we'll use a little for that. And then will I get to... Let's, I don't know if these are the color. Oh, they might actually be the colors I use. So this. Oops. This. And then the little should work fine. So actually these colors might be totally fine. So let's put... That in there. And we'll put this one here. Okay, and then we'll grab... I think this one. Whoops. And... We will stick... This one here. Okay, so for um, Netflix, I've got this. This is the last new um, bandit sheet that I bought today. No bandits on this particular one, but. <clears throat> Oh, that's going to be, oh no, pink or purple. Oh, that is huge. I think it'll be okay. I mean, it is enormous, but it's all right. So that was for the trials of Gabriel Hernandez, which is devastating. Uh, for the driveway visit from my mom, it was unexpected. She just texted and said, I'm going to be driving by in like four to five minutes. And she was just around the corner from us for something. Um, so I just stepped out into the driveway to talk to her. And then I will use this. Yeah, why not? We'll put that one there for filming. Okay. So... That means that we are done our base spread and we can add the pen, which is exciting. I sort of feel like this was the never ending week when it comes to this spread. Like I feel like it took forever to get everything down and to get to Sunday. And maybe I was just eager because I wanted to see it completed. I don't know. I kind of want to exchange this for the next size up on this sheet. Um, it might be too big though, let's see. No, I think it'll be fine. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay, so I am going to go in and add the pen and I'll be right back to show you the finished product.
there we go my finished Erin Condren memory keeping spread for the week of April 22nd through May 3rd which is tonight I am super thrilled that this spread is done and I like the way that it turned out not my favorite kid not my favorite either um, and I think it came together pretty nicely so I hope that you enjoyed the video